A few weeks ago, it was Christ the King that earned the Brooklyn Queens basketball title over Zavarian. And now we're here at Fordham University for the annual city championship, and it's no surprise that we have ourselves a rematch. Just like the Brooklyn Queens championship was close the whole way, the city championship featured plenty of great action, with Christ the King once again earning the victory 59 to 56. I really wanted to win, so I just did whatever it took to get my team in the W. I feel like I got enough firepower on that bench to keep the game where it needs to be. We got guys that can straight up play and, and compete, and that's all that, you know, that's the difference that a game like this makes. Junior guard Raleigh Alkins earned MVP honors after a 21-point, five-rebound performance. Sophomore guard Jose Alvarado added 14 points, and junior forward Tyrone Cohen finished with 10 points and seven rebounds. It feels amazing. It's history to be one of the few three city championships in a row. If I come back next year, that would be amazing. I'd try to go for four. In these championship games, you're going to have, like, Raleigh's going to do what he does, Alvarado's going to do but you need something else. Cohen's 10-7, and seven, you know what I mean? Dave Cole's put-back rebound. Those things are the things that make you win. The city championship victory is the third straight for Christ the King and the school's fifth out of the past six years. The Royals led by just three points at the start of the fourth quarter but the team went on a run to seal the victory. This one feels good. This one I felt like, you know, like, it's the hardest thing in sports to do is to three-peat, and we were able to. The fourth quarter, it was just about creating shots, getting open shots, and getting the job done. That was all that counts. While the Royals are once again deserving champions, Zavarian put up a great fight. Senior forward Sayon Charles recorded a double-double with 16 points and 13 rebounds, and senior forward Najee Larcher added 10 points. Jack Alisi can flat out coach, you know, he's been doing it for 20 years. He gets his guys to buy into the system, to play hard for him. And then they got a bunch of like, you know, they got five guys that can really play. Guys are in double figures, so we're never going to blow them out. You know, that's not going to happen. They're too good. They gave it the all. They made their run, but we made ours and we finished the game with it. It's been a fun ride for Christ the King throughout this year's playoffs, but the fun doesn't stop here as the Royals will now gear up for the State Federation Tournament to be held in less than two weeks in Albany. Reporting for Currents, I'm Jim Mancari.